What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. So Cassie has finally broken her silence regarding the hotel hallway footage that was released by CNN some days ago. In case you haven't seen it, the video shows Diddy mistreating Cassie in the most humiliating way possible. Cassie was trying to escape from him when he chased her down the hallway, caught up with her at the elevator and started stomping on her. He then dragged her back to the room, and when she got out and tried to make a call on one of the phones, he threw a glass vase at her. It was really bad. So obviously after CNN released this video, Diddy got a lot of backlash because initially when Cassie filed her lawsuit back in November 2023, accusing him of essay among other things, he denied the allegations. His lawyer, Ben Braffman, even said, a decision to settle a lawsuit, especially in 2023, is in no way an admission of wrongdoing. Mr. Combs' decision to settle the lawsuit does not in any way undermine his flat-out denial of the claims. He is happy they got to a mutual settlement and wishes Miss Ventura the best. They basically made it seem like she was just a money-hungry liar looking for a cash grab which was totally unfair. So after the footage came out, Diddy issued this BS public apology saying he was sorry and he is a changed man putting in the work in rehab or whatever. It's so difficult to reflect on the darkest times in your life. But sometimes you gotta do that. I was stuck. I mean, I hit rock bottom. But I make no excuses. My behavior on that video is inexcusable. I take full responsibility for my actions in that video. I'm disgusted. I was disgusted then when I did it. I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. I had to go into therapy and go into rehab. I had to ask God for his mercy and grace. I'm so sorry. But I'm committed to be a better man each and every day. I'm not asking for forgiveness. I'm truly sorry. However, the backlash didn't stop because from that video, you can tell that he isn't just apologizing because he realized his mistakes. He is apologizing because he got caught in 4K. Anyway, Cassie is now speaking out for the first time, I believe, since she filed her lawsuit. She posted this statement to her Instagram saying, thank you for all of the love and support from my family, friends, strangers, and those I have yet to meet. The outpouring of love has created a place for my younger self to settle and feel safe now. But this is only the beginning. Domestic violence is the issue. It broke me down to someone I never thought I would become. With a lot of hard work, I am better today, but I will always be recovering from my past. Thank you to everyone that has taken the time to take this matter seriously. My only ask is that everyone open your heart to believing victims the first time. It takes a lot of heart to tell the truth out of a situation that you were powerless in. I offer my hand to those that are still living in fear. Reach out to your people. Don't cut them off. No one should carry this weight alone. This healing journey is never ending, but this support means everything to me. Thank you. Love always, Cassie. I really do hope and pray she continues to thrive in her healing journey because she went through a lot. Seeing that video only makes you imagine what she had to endure behind closed doors. It only makes you imagine what Kim Porter went through and everybody else that Diddy has tormented. Anyway, do let me know your thoughts on in the comments down below, hit that subscribe button, and give this video a thumbs up. Also, we have a membership for some of y'all who would like to support the channel, so check out the link in the description to join. Catch you in the next one.